Hi all and welcome to Magus Crag Gaming. Alright, we got a little bit worm unlimited again. I'm on my old computer again because my CPU is still on the fritz with my, my brand new computer. Well, not new, but 10 year old. So I, I got a little work to do on that. So for now we're going to be playing a little worm and maybe some Eve. Uh, we'll see. Eve was not uh, connecting today, so we are playing worm. And I got a message. We're going to ignore that for now. Alright, let's see here. I need tools. <clears throat> I need my hatchet. And we're going to chop this down. We recently acquired a little bit more property, which means we can kind of figure out what we want to do with building. I haven't really, I don't have any particular plans. I'm just going to kind of wing it and go with what I want to go with. And this section of area we have gotten all plotted out it could be a good area to build something with um we'll we'll, we'll determine that what we're going to do with it but let's look here i think everything is grown over because it's had time to grow over so uh we're going to have to kind of map this out again um this interior section by what I mean is it's on the interior of my property but this section over here is on the exterior and I don't know how far it goes so we're gonna do this we're gonna grab our shovel and we're gonna slowly pack this <coughs> excuse me alright now that's packed this we're gonna pack as well because that is flat and we're going to want to extend this even farther most likely but that is my marker now I'm going to get in my cart and we're going to go back to where my uh, token is and we're going to check now I didn't know all the server rules before I started this and I was just gathering dirt um, you can do that um, you can gather dirt and stuff from various spots you just you're not supposed to like map out areas and it sort of was like I was just gathering dirt and it was a mistake on my part but they've been pretty uh, cool about it so um, but I did extend that into my property so it's actually legit now but next the next time I do something like that I'm going to want to probably just work on the area I'm working on and then uh, uh, slowly drip out and that's something I'm going to have to do now I just wanted to make it right and now it's right it's part of my property I believe so I'm going to just make sure so we're going to examine the settlement <clears throat> we're going to go down to show village plan and we're going to come out here and okay so I need one more plot this way so let's close that so if I get one more plot or one more square of that direction then it'll be where I want it to be so let's actually check settlement no we want to check bank and we're gonna withdraw I'll just see how much we have in there we have two copper and 46 iron so it's gonna take us a couple more days <coughs> <coughs> Of voting on this server before I can get that that plot sectioned off or I can just leave it but I will extend eventually but you're allowed to do a little bit uh, to an extent so there's like give and take so um, I've read over the gist of the rules um, but it, I mean if you're playing on this server you're gonna want to read them read them as many times as you need to uh, just so you can get a feel for them and the admins are cool they're cool they're like they're helpful and they give leeway so I mean don't don't worry too much all right so what do we want to do right now well you know let's check I got my two guards there let's check our perimeter again for our village all right so to the west I can go from this I can go two four six eight ten so I can go ten 
Oh yeah, that's right. I'm 10, 10, 10, 20. Okay, so I can go 10 steps this way from this. Okay. Let's uh, do this. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. We are going to dig this just to dig it. All right. We're going to take that dirt. Now, this gives us a perimeter where we know where we're at. Um, I may want to put fencing up, but um, I want to be careful what I do because it's still early. I want to map this out. I want to work it and get it how I want it. So um, it's gonna be it's gonna be a process. So let's see here. And if that is ten this way, then this marker we can go ten this way. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so this, this right here, I should put something here. I don't know what I want to put here. Maybe a, I could put a sign here, or I could just remember it's off the corner of that tree. Um, okay, so all this area is good. Now, I could go hunting, and I could earn some uh, coins right now, but I have to kill smaller stuff. But if I get my guards to help me, what is that? It looks huge. Mature champion, huge spider. Holy cow, that is big. Uh, you know, I kind of want to drag one of those in and see how much experience I can get by helping my guard kill it. So let's get on this cart. Let's get do something a little risky. Now we don't have a bed or anything or a house built. So if we die, we're going to have to place down a tent. So we're going to have to be very careful about this. We don't want to die. But we're going to get real close to this gigantic spider. I feel like the Lord of the Rings movie right now. Let's go in and get it. Let's see if we can get this thing's attention. It's huge and it's probably going to move fast. Uh, it's not air going. Uh, if it's not air going, it's maybe because I'm not in this line of sight. Uh oh, there it goes. Run! Oh, it's coming. Come on, ugly. Let's go, you ugly sucker. You big, ugly, eight-eyed, two-fanged looking dude it up. Yeah, come on, boy. Come down here. Yeah, you're gonna die, and I'm gonna get some insect meat. Maybe uh, extra stuff. Oh, 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 here he comes. Don't want to go too far. Oh, he's getting close now. Okay, where are my guards? There we go. The alarm went off. Okay, he's chasing me, but the guards are going to go in on him. The guards are in on him. Alright, this is a way you can get, like, some points. Okay, now they're attacking us. Now we're going to get off. And we're going to run up there. We're going to click him and attack. Alright. Alright. Okay, the two guards are on him, and I'm on him. Alright. Let's look at combat. Now this, because I'm helping my guards, this will give me some coins. And because this is a champion, mature, huge spider, it's probably going to be a good amount. Mmm! I didn't even notice how low my water and my food are. I've got to eat. So the once I kill this spider, I'm going to butcher it, bury the corpse, and uh, I can't figure out how to burn it. Otherwise, I'd burn it for extra coins. But. Oh, local. 
All right, good deal. All right. Now let's go to not inventory backpack. I'm gonna grab my butchery knife that I made, and we're gonna butcher this bad boy. Now we're gonna open them. All right, we're gonna take all of this. Actually, we're going to highlight it all. Shift will do that. And we will take. And then we're just going to bury it. Uh, just so other creatures don't come. <coughs> Alright. There we go. Now let's see how much we were awarded. Do, did we get awarded anything? Event. Hmm, I don't know how much I was awarded. Um, I didn't see. Let's see here. Let's go to bank. Withdraw, let's see. Two copper and some change. So that's good. We made two copper. Alright, so we're gonna, I think that's what our episode is gonna be for today, is gonna be killing some stuff. So, we'll, we're gonna get the money we need to get our property expanded. Wow. Oh, these guys are going slow. I need some water. I, I just forgot about that. So, let's see here. We're gonna get in here. Um, this water skin is looking pretty shabby. It's hurt. We're gonna drink out of that. Okay, and we've got our fill. Uh, now, let's, I didn't want to do that. Let's hop off, and we're going to cook something real quick. I mean, this is like a survival game. I mean, you've got you've to gotta cook stuff, or else you're not going to be, you got to cook and drink. That's partly why I like this. You know, the Life is Feudal game <coughs> that I play, and I will mention that game because that's a very excellent game like this. It's a, a little bit different, but it's still an excellent game. Um, that particular game w does not have anything with drinking, and that kind of frustrates me. It doesn't, but it does. But if they were to add drinking into that game, like even if it was ale or water or whatever, if they were to add those things, it would make it a much more realistic and interesting game. So... Uh, maybe I'd like I would like to see them do that, but they don't have to. The game is still good. Let's see what am I doing here? I want to open this. Okay, we're gonna take out a pumpkin. <coughs> we're gonna take out. Let's see here. Let's put it right here, and we're gonna take out two pumpkins because we need a good amount of food. We're gonna check our corn. We've got five and five, so we've got a good amount of corn. We're just gonna take out one corn for now and no we're gonna take out three corn two more so we'll take out that we're gonna take these lower quality potatoes all of them so the thing is is you wanna produce and produce and produce uh, so do what you need and then take the extra and produce so you have more that's that's that goes with anything in life Take what you need and use the extra to produce more. That way you can have an abundance. I mean, it's principle. All right, now let's see here. We're gonna, we got our shovel. So we're going to go right here. We're going to, where is it? Snot plat. Oh, it's, okay. The list is too long. We're going to cultivate. Let's do a 3x3 three three tile. That way we cultivate everything around us. <laughs> And this may take us a little bit of time because we're still hungry. Ah, I'm getting ahead of myself, aren't I? Okay, let's get our pottery bowl down here by the dirt. We're going to open this up. We're going to take both pumpkins and put those in the pottery bowl. We're going to take one corn, put that in the pottery bowl. We're going to take both meats, put it in the pottery bowl. And we're going to put a tomato in the pottery bowl. 
Now there's a list of cooking items that you can do, like uh, cooking specials and stuff, like what you can cook. But uh, I haven't really delved into that. I would like to delve into that. I would definitely like to delve into that more and get some more uh, interesting topics for this game out there. Uh, or uh, just interesting things to do in the game, things you can explore. And we're going to put one potato as well in there. And then we're going to take these potatoes and we're going to plant them now. Right now, I don't have a whole lot of extra food. I haven't been playing that much. Real life's been happening, so but so we've got that. Now we can plant two more items and maybe even more. So let's grab a couple more items. Let's open this up. We're gonna stick this and this in here. Um, that dirt we're gonna get rid of real quick here. So you just want to police what you can as you go. So let's open this up. That is not working. There we go. Alright, we're going to throw that extra dirt in there. As you can see, I have a lot of WEMP saved up. And I also have, particularly, I forgot about that. Yesterday I put some WEMP in here. And my water skin is damaged. Let's see here. Uh, let's repair this crate. And let's get in here. There's my WEMP. It's not damaged, but I'm going to pull that out because it won't get damaged. Uh, let's take as many as we can. It will not get damaged if I put it in a crate. Now this leather skin, this water skin, I can keep using. So I'm going to put that right in here. It's going to be extra weight, but I'm going to pull it out. Let's see if we can't get it in here. There we go. Now I, I can use that. I picked that up somewhere. I can't remember where. Hey, looky there. There's some dirt. Um, let's keep this organized. So, organization is key to anything. You want to be organized in life. You want to be organized in gameplay. I mean, organization really helps. So let's open this up. We're going to pull this dirt out. We'll pull that out. We'll throw this in here. All right, now we're doing really good here. Oh, I went around the wrong way. That's okay. It's a maze. It's a maze. Find our way through the maze. Okay, let's open this up. <coughs> and uh, let's put that right there. And then we'll transfer it to here. All right, now let's look. Water skins are... Compass is damaged. Our treasure maps are damaged. Uh, let's see here. Ropes. I've got some ropes in here that are all damaged, but I found some excess ropes. Um, I mean, I hope they're not getting more damaged as they sit in there, but I don't want to hold on to them right as of yet. So, And this has some extra water in it. So, And thankfully, you can still drink salty water. You know it would be cool, which I've seen in other games, uh, if they made it where you could burn off the uh, water in like a, a cauldron or something and then you could actually have salt and clean water but they don't have to do that I like it the way it is it's simpler it's much more easier to do what I want to do so I mean there's just games are different so you don't you don't want everything to be the same but those are some differences that's uh that reminds me of a game outward that game is fantastic I'm telling you what all right I just love games in general, guys. Okay, we are going to grab, let's see, potatoes aren't too bad, corn's not too bad, tomatoes, those are not too bad. So let's grab, we're going to grab the, we're going to leave the lower quality, no, we're going to grab the lower quality. Let's grab one tomato, let's grab one cabbage. Um, actually we're going to grab another tomato, and we're going to grab one more cabbage. Now that should give us just about what we need. Pumpkins, I'm going to grab one more of those. Usually when you grow pumpkins, you get about one, depending on your skill, you get about, you get about three pumpkins, especially if you can't watch them all the time. So, 
here let's get down here I think we stuck some of this stuff in here we did so we're gonna grab this we're gonna crush this for some seeds and this tomato we're gonna take and we're gonna ooh we're gonna leave that little eight one there we're gonna pick the seeds for this one pick the seeds for that one the cabbage we are going to pick the seeds and pick the seeds we're not even going to use cabbage okay we're going to leave all that how that is now let's plant this food back in the day people used to do this for living and now well, some people still do it it's actually a lot different but uh, I mean there are people that still do it otherwise we wouldn't have food in the world but I just like to play games about it so hey now see you can water the ground and stuff and fertilize the ground I mean I think I don't know what you need for fertilizing that's something I'll have to figure out but this I believe that's modded but that's that's cool though it makes it unique and fun so let's grab our shovel we're gonna go ahead we're gonna cultivate we're gonna step right here cultivate we're gonna do a three by three tile too hungry okay I knew it I knew that was gonna be a factor okay so let's see here let's look up here Kindle we got plenty of Kindle so we're gonna open our backpack we're gonna grab our flint and steel and we're gonna create a campfire 81 percent good deal all right, we got our campfire, our beautiful red glowing campfire. And we're going to put our pottery bowl on that. And we're just going to take a load off. We're going to sit by the campfire and uh, in the grass, which would probably catch on fire in real life. But thank God it's just the game. Okay, let's see here. We want to sit down. Let's see if I can remember how to sit in this game. Uh, shoot, I cannot remember how to sit in this game. <clears throat> there is a way to do it. Horseshoes will be good to be made. Blacksmithing is definitely something I'm going to be looking into. Okay. All right. Uh, next agenda. I think what I'm going to do is down in that area where I was at earlier where it's all planned out. I think I'm going to build a pen for these animals. And I will be collecting more animals and feeding them. That is working for now. I don't think any of those are getting disease, but the only thing is, is they're, they're growing. So, um, as they grow, they will die, and it's inevitable. So, I have a sheep and a ram. I want to breed that, really. Let's breed those. I should breed the horses, too. Uh, let's get this. Uh, let's get a lead on them. Okay, we're going to get a lead on this. All right, where is, let's lead him over here. Uh, this might be difficult. Okay, they're close now. I want to have sheep. I want to have sheep. Okay, stop moving. Come on. Oh, dang, that's frustrating. Okay, let's see if they're close enough. Too far away to do that. Okay, now they're breeding. Let's see if I have enough husbandry to do it. Good, good, okay. The bull and the cows, I think, I think I want to breed them, but I'm not sure. Actually, these two bulls are her boys, so that interbreeding could really make some problems. Um, I need some more cows is what I need, but let's see. Let's breed these horses real quick. Uh, actually, where's that ram? We'll get the ram, and we'll de-lead him. All right, so we're getting ahead of ourselves, but we're going to deal with it because we need to have this done. We want to have this. Okay, perfect. Okay, so the horse, the horse and the sheep have been bred. Oh, 
I don't want to pull him out of there. I want to keep him in there. All right, so we might change what we're doing here. We might actually build some more area for them to be housed. And you kind of want to section them off because it's not always easy to remember what's what. Although, I mean, I have a pretty good memory, so I'm remembering what's what. And actually, if we go over, where's that cart? Where, this cart. This bull is the dad of this bull and those other two bulls. And that is the mother. So, I do remember that. And there is another spider I want to get. It's an AIDS fear spider. I want to get that over here. Let's check our food. Alright. Let's, Let's see, see here. here. Breakfast. And, and it's, it's almost five pounds worth of food. We're going to take that. And we're going to get in here. And get it open. Get that off the top. And let's, let's, let's eat this. Let's see what it gives us. Insight about rake. Oh, that's good. That would be cool. 30 seconds worth of insight to rake. That's a recipe I should keep. Oh, it's, it's going up. It's going up as I eat. Oh, wow. That filled me up a lot. Really fast. I made a good food. I don't even know how I did that, but I just made a good food. All right, let's see here. Let's grab our shovel, and we're going we're gonna to right-click, and we're going to cultivate three. Wow, that gives me 40 seconds. Of, that is going to be, that food is going to be good. I want to store it somewhere, but I don't have anywhere to really store it. Um, the one place I can store it is possibly in the cart. It might last a little longer in the cart, but if I keep it on person, it's going to go to waste real quick. So that filled me up really good, and it gave me 40-some seconds to break. So that's actually a good, good learning experience right there. So let's put this in there. And hopefully I can get back to it before it's all gone again. Now we've got four spots here. One, three spots here. No, four spots. Five spots. Perfect. I think that's what, that's good. Okay. We can plant two more items. So we'll do that. Let's get these cabbage seeds planted. We're planting them right on the fire, but that's okay. Oh, we did not want to move that. Let's get that back where it was. Okay, bingo. Alright. Uh, oh, we can't plant there. We don't want to plant where that is. Those two items we don't want to plant there. We'll plant right here. So we will have one more spot to plant. So this is a small step, obviously, but it's a, it's a start. Okay, let's see here. Let's get into here. And let's grab, what do we got? We got two, we've got seven corn eight potatoes let's go with cabbage no do I want, yeah I want more cabbage cabbage is good let's get a little more cabbage going here so we we're gonna pick the seeds on this cabbage although I don't know how that works in real life but this is worm not real life worm unlimited Okay, now we've got some good crops planted here. All right, let's check our time, see what we got time-wise. Ooh, it is time for me to get off here pretty quick. I think that's all we're going to be able to do, guys. So uh, that's the start. It's the start still. We're still working slowly, but uh, we're, we're getting there. All right, I would love to play more, but I have to go to work. So the more you guys like and subscribe, the more you'll see of this and the more I'll have time to do it. So let's get off here. So uh, that's the video. Like, subscribe, comment, and uh, yeah, this is Warm Unlimited.